before I answer that, like you know the things you have to do to play college basketball. You know you have to be, you have to shoot. You know you have to defend. You have to communicate. You know you can't. You go play pickup with college guys, or you go to a, a tryout. You can't just stay on the sideline. Like you, you know, everybody in here knows the things you have to do to take it to the next level. There's no secret. But you can't be too cool, and you can't be too scared to do those things. You can't be on the sideline, and your boys are over there, kind of goofing around and you know that you have to stretch before you feel like you're ready to go but you want to goof around to be cool like you have to be willing to go through your stretching routine when it comes out there um, like the answer here you know there's a tryout or whatever and you're gonna be scared but there's nothing worse than getting the end of a tryout and regretting like man I should have I should have tried to take him I should have talked I should have done this I should have been the first guy in the line I should have demonstrated I should have thanked the coach afterwards again you know every single thing that you need to do everybody who's here if you you know, if you're online, you're finding programs, you're listening to coaches and high-level guys, you know what you need to do, but you can't be too cool and you can't be too scared to do those. You can't say it enough. If, if college basketball is not going to be your route, if you end up not being recruited to the level that you'd like to or you want to go to a super high academic school and the only schools that are recruiting you are low academic division threes, managing or walking on are both tremendous routes. Um, managers get hired front office and all these guys can attest managers will get hired into the NBA front office or to coach on college staffs much more quickly than former players unless you're a former NBA all-star. Would you guys all would you guys all agree? Every single one of them is shaking their head yes. It's not embarrassing. You're a part of something bigger than yourself, which is the biggest thing you can ever do in life. And if you want a career in basketball, it's, it's the route to go. Are you diving on the floor for loose basketballs? Are you taking charges? Are you communicating? Carmelo's on the floor. Ty's on the floor. Cole Anthony's on the floor. Donovan Mitchell's on the floor. In between games, what do you think they were doing? What do you think those guys do? Between games and pickup. Yeah, we gotta ice the ball screen when Don comes off of it. He's killing us with that. Literally talking through the IQ side of the game in pickup. You can't hear yourself think because it's so loud because everybody's talking in the gym. And not not talking trash, not oh, I got you, not that. They communicate every single ball screen. Pin downs are said. We'll switch this, we'll switch this, we'll switch this. He can't shoot. Hey, hey, push him this way, push him this way. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. And whether it's Carmelo Anthony, who's one of the greatest players, one of the greatest scorers in the history of the game, or whether it's, I think there are some guys here who are 13, those are things that you can do every single day out. But for those guys, those things are instincts just as much as Carmelo's fadeaway or you know, Donovan Mitchell's ability to get to the rim and finish. Things that you control, can control. And it's, it's not the sexy stuff, but it's the winning stuff. And winning gets you noticed. We haven't watched UVA play. And I mean, they've taken a ton of heat the past several years. They won the national championship this year. They had three guys drafted, including a lottery pick. So they are a blue blood. Past five years, they've been the best team in the ACC record-wise. And they've won more regular season and tournament championships. They're a solid team. We watched their summer practice, and they spent an hour working out where shots weren't taken, where they'd worked on closeouts over and over and over and over again. Things that you can control, things that aren't going to show up on Instagram, but things that are going to get you recruited. Like I said, I know it's not, it's not the sexy stuff, and it's not the da-da-da-da-da, hezzy, blah-blah-blah. Some guys like my man here, like he's had his head down, he's yawning. Like I know this is boring him to death, but if you're serious about being an elite player, those are the things that can truly translate and you control 100%. Mentality, consistency, doing the right things, and showing up. Look at guys like TJ McConnell, Matthew Delavadova. With a lot of those guys, you show up on time, you do the little things, and you're going to remain on the team. Then you have guys who are, you have, are usually you know, heralded guys that came out of high school and college and first-round picks who don't stick around because they don't do the little things. So taking care of what you control, controlling what you control is going to be the high school level, the college level, or the NBA level is the ticket to staying there. A lot of guys get to the NBA, and they feel like they've made it. But then there are other guys who getting there is just first step, and staying there is what they want to do. Um, and then at the same time, the NBA is a circus. Some guys love the game. Some guys love the love that you get from the game. Um, and the guys that love the love, they're, unless they're that upper, upper echelon, they're not going to be around. And obviously, like I said, the same thing goes for high school, same thing goes for college. This is unlike anything I've ever been to before. The intensity is way higher at this camp. The coaches hold you to a higher standard. They treat you like the player you're supposed to be. It's really nice to have coaches that personally talk to you. and We're all treating each other like brothers. If you're not 100% devoted about basketball, don't come. This is what you need if you want to play at the next level. One, two, three. G -G -G.